To you, my love, I leave the second best beds. The world's dragged up dregs and drowned regrets. I leave lakes that have bled their dappled beauty long dead. And I leave dread. So that every time you place a foot, the thought that the ground could come loose parades through your head. I leave your lungs and loves unfed, your green spaces stained red. I leave, taking with me all I have found. And instead, you can have whatever's left. To you, I hand down a tortured horizon marked by my mistakes, fires fakes, days comprising of a seasonless haze and a lifetime's fight for intangible change. I give you a place void of brightness, not the world I knew, but a charcoal likeness and a tightness in your frail chest so that at best you'll get to see your twenties through. I would give you the sky if I could, but it's too scored and scorched from long-haul holidays. So for my youngest, I leave an apology. That you will never let the citrus lick of dew stain your fingers. Nor the smell that lingers after the rain frame your autumn days. I'm sorry for those still nights when you won't be looking up at stars charting those stories that should have been ours, the powerless pyre in the pit of your being. For bequeathing that feeling, I can only apologise. Because I chose to turn the other cheek, turn my back, keep my eyes firmly closed, as if I didn't know that this world is not a temporary home, it's not on loan, it's not due back. As soon as I am gone, we might just be passing through. But what are you passing on? Thank you.